What is so ridiculously overpriced, yet you still buy? Food with current inflation. Else you die. Rent. Health insurance medical supplies. Right now? Cars, at least in my area. Brand new cars are few and far between. And it's not unusual to see used cars with prices 10k to 12k above what the price was a year and a half ago. It's insane. Pretty much all the things I need to stay alive. Concessions at sporting events. As much as I try my best to eat before I go and resist the urge to buy beer when I am there, some days, seeing others enjoying their beer and food snacks make me say F it and I indulge too. Lettuce. Groceries. Warhammer 40k minis. Glasses I could always buy cheap ones, but I'd rather pay money to have nice frames that I actually like wearing rather than a pair I couldn't care less about. I can't believe how much people spend on alcohol at a bar. Razor refills. Edit thank you Redditors are so great I will order safety razors today. Insulin. Health insurance that covers next to nothing. Fucking graphics cards. They are getting better but like half a decade ago I bought a mid-range graphics card for the PC connected to my living room TV. I fully expected it would go outdated fast, but with the chip shortages and stuff anything that's more than a slight upgrade is stupid expensive still. I want something that does ray tracing, but I don't want to pay an arm and a leg for it. Fucking toilet paper. After people panic bought in 2020, it's so much more than it used to be. Stands out against the rising price of everything else. Electricity. Concert tickets. My antidepressants. Kerrygold butter. Business class, no contest. But I'm old and have lived frugally all my life, flying steerage, driving cheap cars, etc. etc., so now I can afford it occasionally. First time flying business this year, actually it's nice. Potato chips. Homes. Health insurance. I'm self-employed, I have to use the state health insurance marketplace. It was a good deal when it was first introduced, but the health insurance lobbies have just pushed prices higher and higher and now I'm just paying a premium for being alive. Beef jerky. 7.99 for 80 g. Fruits, milk, veggies, meat, olive oil, mattress, vacuum cleaner and the list goes on. Every effing thing is 40-50 expensive now. Feels like price gouging. Therapy. It's definitely overpriced for my budget but still worth every penny. Menstruation stuff. Heating. Everything post-COVID. Inflation should be told like the weather. 8% but it feels like 350. Uber Eats fees. I wish I could give it directly to the delivery guy. Coffee. Cigarettes, pay a shitload just to off yourself quicker. Still don't understand why I still smoke face with tears of joy. City life. Laundry detergent. Food. Tampons. Coffee. Games by EA. Not pulling out. Magic the Gathering cards lol I shit talk people for spending $200 on shoes then I'll spend that much on one teeny, tiny piece of cardboard ha ha. Gym membership. I use it consistently enough, but still. Houses. My apartment. Whiskey. Being an alcoholic is expensive. Microwave rice. Gluten-free bread. In Ireland? Fucking everything. Almost everything at this point is. Especially food and drinks packages got smaller, prices got higher. 
pretty soon a GPU. Paper products i.e. books, photocopies etc. Analog preamps and DA converters. Takeaways. IPA beer in Japan, the prices are crazy but I enjoy the taste of bitter beer. Everything, everywhere, all of the time. Beef jerky. White cheddar cheese it grooves at $6 a box, a uh. Paper plates, I spent $23 for a pack of paper plates yesterday. Well besides basic things like housing, groceries and transportation, Spotify and YouTube premium. These are both particularly expensive in my country, but it's something I choose to pay for as I use it daily and I can't stand the ads. Insulin. Groceries. Insulin. PC parts. Health insurance. Health insurance. Electricity, at least in Sweden. Groceries, especially the healthy ones honestly.